2020 is ending. So let me just tell you this, guys. This year has been crazy, so for once, I'm going to take the sunglasses off and try to do this as my usual look-alike self. This year has been the worst. Can we all agree with that? You can raise your hand and say this has been the worst year for legit everybody. Now, for, before I begin, I'm not going to mention anything about religion or politics. You, can, you want something like that, watch someone else's video or channel or something like that. But either way, let me tell you this, guys. This has really been the worst year for everyone. This has been literally a nightmare. A legit, the whole year has been a nightmare. You know, COVID, you know, the pandemic, the George Floyd thing, <clears throat> you know, people saying, people losing their trust in the police, people, um, oh my God, the fact theaters are now suffering and losing money. Yes. Before I go any further, yes, I have worked for a movie theater. I'm not going to tell you the name or where it's located. I don't want you guys to know too much of that information. But I can tell you that... <sighs> movie theaters have been suffering. Because now people are going to a lot of streaming services. You know, HBO Max, Disney Plus, and all the above. Now, if they're not watching it in the theater, we're going to be watching it at home. Because that's most most people are spending their most time at watching movie, movies at home. I don't know what kids are doing for school, but uh, what I've heard, kids are... <sighs> kids are like, oh, we're free. We can do whatever we want. We don't have to worry about school. Like, yeah, pretty much. But either way, um, let me just get down to the point. This year is, has been the worst. But we know what the good news is. <sighs> we made it to this year. That is the good news. We've all made it to this year. We made it through this year. Yes, we've lost. a few people this year. We've lost so many people this year because of COVID, because of other things. Yes, we have lost a few people this year. A few people that were very talented, who did not deserve to die. But, you know, we made it. Those of you who made it, those of you who got your COVID tests, now that there's a vaccine, now, yeah, we have to wait until that's more public, but, you know. But let me just tell you this, you know, it's been crazy. Now, now I'm going to stop talking about how bad this year has been. Let me tell you the plan for next year. Now, I want to try to make this more of an upbeat video. Now, I mentioned the bad, I mentioned what people have been worried about this year. So, let me just tell you what my plan is for next year. So, my plan to hopefully get some of my material and try to get gain more subscribers. When I mean more subscribers, let's try to make more than maybe 300. If I can make more than 300, you know, that's that might make a difference. But, I want to try to make enough subscribers and have something that people want to come back again and again and see basically so let me tell you this um, for f short films now let me just let you guys know a thing that I'm gonna let all of you 
who are subscribed to me know there will all right beginning of next month and the month after there will be no new short film I'm not now for anyone says anything it's not because of COVID it's not because of that COVID in the New England area is getting a little bit too dangerous. A lot of people here in Boston are kind of like, you know, dude, don't come near me. Don't come near me. Keep your distance. Yeah, that's what most people in Boston are like. They're like, dude, stay where you are. Don't come near me. Don't hug me. Don't do any of that crap. But let me just tell you this, you know, I'm not postponing my films because of COVID. That's not the reason. Here in the New England areas, Boston, and I might as well say New York and this part of the country, gets cold. I mean, it gets pretty freaking cold. Like the last I remember, it was like below 20 degrees. Below 20 freaking degrees. And I'm like, no, I'm. Okay, I don't want to hear from my actors saying that, oh, Alex, well, it's too cold out here. Can we go inside or something like that? Like, I don't want to hear that from my actors. Now, while I'm on the subject, because of COVID, I will get, I will start making movies somewhere around March. Late March, mid March, or whatever. I'm just, I'm just letting you guys know because you know, it's getting a little crazy here because of COVID. You know, most of the people are like you know staying inside. Most people are wearing masks. Most of the people are getting their COVID tests. Certain areas where groups of people, well, I'm gonna say groups, are lining up to get their COVID tests to see if they're not. COVID positive, but you know, either way, I just want you guys to know, you know, it's not because of COVID that I'm not going to be making more short films in the next two months. It's because, you know, it's the weather. My plans to film is not, you know, centered around snow and the cold, basically. So I just want you guys to know. It's not because of COVID, it's because of the weather and maybe also COVID also. It's just, all right, I'll say that. I'll say that too. But let me just tell you this, you know, if you haven't, you know, noticed, I've not heard from mo most of my subscribers. Now, I've heard recent subscribers before, but I want to try to, next year I would like to hopefully look for a new job. I'm just like, now I'm also letting people on Facebook know I'm also trying to look for a new job also. Because as of right now, um, my unemployment <laughs> has expired. It's either expired or I have to wait the next week to get my unemployment, you know, benefits, but, you know, just let you know, my unemployment has now stopped, so, I need to find a job, I need to find some type of work to, you know, help me pay my bills, my rent, my rent, basically, so, I'm just trying to find something to do. Something that's not too crazy, something that's not gonna let me deal with a lot of things. I'm not gonna tell you which what, but I'm trying to find a new job now with the theater. Now, say for example, if theaters do reopen again, I don't know. No one knows. We don't know if most of us who most of my employees that I keep in contact with, or I try to keep in contact with, you know, they they don't know, I don't know what they're doing nowadays. Some of my other employees that I used to work with, you know, 
I, you know, keep in contact with them, you know, we, you know, keep in contact on sort of a daily basics, or if I'm trying to film something, we try to be as safe as possible, you know, I always bring hand sanitizer, or make sure the mask is sanitized, or whatever I have sanitized, you know, that's why I keep saying, gotta play it safe, so, yeah, so, Anyways, like I said, there will be no new short films in the next two months. But if you haven't seen my short film that I just recently released, definitely check that out. We worked really hard on that. I worked really hard on it. We all worked really hard, honestly. So what's the plan for next year? Well, besides me getting more subscribers, I want to try and join a film class. I told my mom this. I might as well tell you guys this. I want to join a film class. And I know also you guys have also been saying to me, so Alex, I just asked, want to ask a question. Have you ever thought about releasing your films at a film festival? And yes, I have. It's just one thing though. Know. How? So, what you guys don't know, last, sorry, the beginning of this year, I did try to release my film, Atomic Sentinel, at a film festival, and I did all the things I could probably do. I added my Facebook page, I added my, you know, I guess my YouTube, I guess I couldn't add my YouTube. So, basically, where I went to was Filmway, film, filmfreeway.com. I went there and went through all the bullet points of that. So did I find did and I submitted, and it still said you know you still need to do like one more thing, and that is a website which I don't have. Now I have my YouTube channel, my Facebook you know, page, and, you know, I have those two things. I'm trying to get, I'm trying to make an Instagram account, I'm trying to have the time to make an Instagram account, you know, see how that works, basically. But, um, so basically three things I'm trying to, you know, work on. My YouTube channel, my Facebook account, um, and also trying to make an Instagram account. So three things I want to do. And if anyone says uh, you should make a Twitter account, no. Sorry about that. So let me just tell you know, I'm gonna try to probably work with someone to help me make. A website, a, a, sort of a website, you know, that says, I don't know, Alex the Vertical Spy, an Alex Holiday film, or whatever name I can come up with, or something like that. So, yes, so when I went to filmway.com, filmfreeway.com, sorry, they were like, you know, you have to have a website in order to submit your short film. So, sorry about that, no. That's something I think I want to wait until I have the time to, if I had a, my website, if I had a website of my own, which I know that would cost a lot of money. So that's why I'm more concerned about, you know, trying to make, you know, trying to join a film class and, you know, trying to join something. Because even though I'm not much of a joiner, I have to commit, to be honest. I gotta commit. So let me just let you know, guys. You know that's my main plan for next year: joining a film class, making a website, and what else? Try to get my films so pe more people can see them. Cause I'm, I don't want to work really hard all for nothing. Like I don't want to make something that's not gonna get me like, you know, maybe at least a hundred views. So if you haven't seen my short film I released, you know, last 
this week or this Sunday, please check it out. We worked really hard on it. I worked really hard. We all worked really hard on that. So, uh, so other things I'm working on. Actually, no, I think that's pretty much it. I know this video may be long. So let me just let you guys know, I want 2021 to be a better year. I want it to be a better year. I want it to be a better, a better, I just want things to be better for next year. I know everybody wants that. A lot of people want that. So please, you know, so my other videos, if you haven't seen them, check them out. And some of my other stuff, if you haven't seen them, please check them out. Please. So, say goodbye to 2020. Hello, 2021. Oh, and one last thing. At least this year, the Sonic movie was good. I do not give a damn what anyone else says. It's pretty much, I have two of my favorite movies that I have in my collection. I know this was a long time ago, but I don't care. These were movies I was waiting for for a long time. So, Vertical Spy, outro. Hi guys, so remember to click the bell for notification and see every next Vertical Spy video you see in the future. So remember, click the bell for notification and also remember to like and share this video and also subscribe. So, bye bye.